Welcome to Differ Diving's YouTube channel. Today I will be talking about my personal impression on the new Crazy Commander Back Inflate VCD. bought my very first piece of equipment which was a BCD in 2015 when I was uh, an advanced open water diver. I only had like 20 dives at that time so I figured a, a, a basic jacket style BCD would be the perfect fit so I went for the Cressy Aquaride. This is a very robust uh, and very comfortable BCD. I have to say though at the time I was quite larger so I bought a large BCD and at that time it fit quite well but now uh, since I became an instructor here in 2019 I've been diving pretty much every single day so I lost a lot of weight so that meant I actually shrunk into the BCD and the BCD no longer fits me at all it uh, hangs very low on my back now and uh, I have to adjust all the straps like to the maximum to actually uh, I mean I'm used to it you know but of course it's not the perfect fit anymore so I decided I needed to transition from that aqua ride to a more maybe a little bit more professional uh, BCD that looks better and that would be a good fit for me now. I decided I wanted to try something different. I wanted to upgrade from um, a jacket style. So I tried a couple of BCDs that we have here at the shop, um, back inflate and also uh, wing and back plate style. Um, since I was already used to Cressy, and seriously, I'm a Cressy fan. The first time I bought my equipment, I bought an entire package with BCD, fins, uh, regulators, and Cressy computer. Most of my equipment has nearly 600 dives and absolutely no problem with it. Seriously, the quality is just amazing. I love it. So I decided to go uh, and check out what Cressy has to offer to upgrade from an Aquaride. And I saw they have a very good variety of back inflate BCDs, but I made my choice and I decided that the one I liked was the Cressy Commander Back Inflate BCD. As you can see, this is also a very robust BCD. The materials are very high quality, nothing to say about that, and it looks so good. It has a very good, elegant, nice, design, uh, the pockets, the details that it has, um, all the markings, the brand, it, I just love it. It's very, very elegant. It looks great. In the Crazy Commander, we have the Velcro straps attached to the BCD. So we have these elastic bands that expand. So it makes a very, very good fit, actually. It's very, very comfortable. Although it would be a little bit of a worry for me. I mean, let's assume, please, please not. But let's assume I gain weight again. <laughs> I think those elastic bands in the waist might start stretching a little bit more. So that might be like a tiny concern. Well, at the beginning I thought that maybe the pockets from the uh, Crazy Commander would be a little bit smaller, but to be honest, I can fit perfectly in one pocket my SMB with maybe a couple of reels inside and on the other pocket you can fit a knife, you can fit torches, uh, if you're an instructor you can fit your slates or whatever teaching material you need in water, so it's very very comfortable, I really really love it. And as an instructor, another thing that it was very important for me, if I wanted to upgrade from a jacket style BCD, which is the BCD that we actually put our uh, open water students in, I didn't want to go for a back plate and wing for example because I wouldn't be able to teach in that one. Uh, usually when you're teaching uh, the skills, for example, to an open water student, it would be very confusing if you're in a, in a harness, for example, with a crotch strap, teaching an open water student who has a jacket style BCD. So that's what I love about the Cressy Commander, that it has the exact same configuration, the same chest strap, the Velcro, and the other uh, release on top with the shoulder straps as well. I 
absolutely love about Cressy is the integrated weight system. We have seen other BCDs with different uh, systems and sometimes it can be very easy to actually remove but then to replace it can be a serious pain seriously but with the Cressy, the Cressy system I just love it I mean it has integrated weight pouches right in front of you behind the uh, pocket and they are actually very very easy to pull out and then to replace so it makes it very very comfortable in case you actually need to remove your weight underwater or on the surface when you're uh, teaching a course for example Bring the funk back You can put also a couple of extra weights in these pockets that it has in the back that go around the cylinder uh, these ones, I, it's, it's a little bit of a love-hate situation here because they're very comfortable to dive with underwater and give you that perfect horizontal position but when you have to change your cylinder and move to another tank it's a pain in the ass to adjust the strap I like it don't get me wrong, for diving, it gives you the perfect horizontal position, it's very good trim. Um, it can be a kind of a pain also if you put uh, blocks in it, because the blocks tend to move a lot more. So I'll try to use the soft weights, I would recommend that. And another thing is, of course, it's a good practice to actually always, but after a dive, take the weights out of the pockets and store them somewhere else. Well, when it comes to materials, Cressy uses very high quality materials. They will last forever, seriously. My Cressy Aquaride has around 600 dives. And the only problem I had with it was because of use, uh, not because of uh, manufacturing problems. It's very well padded. The, uh, the back plate has this padding here the sh in the shoulders as well. And you only have the straps, the straps on their shoulder. You have a lot of more mobility, and you have a lot more space, and it's awesome. I couldn't be happier with my purchase. And I have to say, I'm a crazy girl. I have crazy computer, crazy regulators, crazy fins, and now I have a new crazy Moria wetsuit, three male, to be toasty in winter here in the Caribbean. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up. Also, subscribe to our channel. And if you'd like to get uh, notifications when we post something new, ring the bell icon. Bye!